The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from San Jose, California, Bayley! Highly anticipated matchup. The competitors in this one have been waiting all day to get their hands on each other. She is physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in tonight's match. She calls herself the EST. Accompanied by Candice LeRae from Knoxville, Tennessee, the Raw Women's Champion, Bianca Belair. Winner of the 2021 yeah. Royal Rumble. Don't worry, Saxton, you're the EST of the announce team. The first four letters are D-U-M-B, however. That's not funny at all, Corey. Nothing funny about Bianca Belair from bell to bell. A SmackDown Women's Champion who main evented WrestleMania. I believe that Bianca Belair is both the present and the future of the women's division. No argument from me. There are many more titles and many more main events in the future of the EST. decorated female superstars in all of WWE, the first ever women's Grand Slam champion. But some would argue that Bailey didn't quite reach that next level of superstardom until she shed her hugger persona and developed the mean streak. He she uh, are we gonna see it? Got the cross face applied. Uh oh, the end is can she take much more? Hold on, maneuvers herself out. Let her. Measured up. Oh, a drop kick to the spine. A quick finish. Can she do it? And she kicks out. She probably didn't expect it to put her away there, but she's put her on notice. Oh, and oh, the ass. That's going to hurt. And now, obviously, Corey, Bianca Belair is such a naturally gifted and athletic talent. But you have to admit, she comes up somewhat short here when you consider the experience advantage that the veteran Bailey has over her. Absolutely, Cole, which is why Belair really should make sure not to put the cart before the horse here. Meaning, she needs to think more about being the smartest to take off. Oh, man. <laughs> Producing a trampoline. Bianca out of bottle there. Belair now trying to get out. Another just punishing. Determined as ever. And up the turnbuckles we go. To the skies. Does that finish Bailey off? And shoulders are down. Two count. No, she kicks out. She kicks out. A Bailey is certainly displaying a great amount of toughness. It's not easy to kick out of that. I don't know if Belair has ever been more shocked in her career. That was not at all what she was expecting. Oh man, 
check out this power. Gorilla press slam. Belair in full force here now. Let's see what Belair can do with the opportunity. Into the turnbuckle. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. This oh. is not good. Belair gets countered. Trying to chop her down with a low kick. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Look at that counter from Bailey. And Bailey connected nicely there. The arm absorbing the damage. She's losing some steam now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Uh-oh. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. Ooh, right to the leg. <laughs> Bailey could be thinking about the end. Rose point. Has Bailey ended it there? Cover. There's two. Amazing. It had to have been instincts. That's the only explanation as to how Belair kicked out there. And you have to think how much of a setback that can be for Bailey. She now knows her best wasn't good enough there. Oh, nice. Bianca Belair and Bailey driven by competition, driven by the need to prove who the better woman is. And we are reaping all the benefits. Bailey's gonna fly. This one's about to be over! And the Venice could do it! One, two, shoulder up, shoulder up! She just won't stay down. The ER ready to take the EST out. Kick to the gun. Uh-oh. It got like Bailey. She should hold her head high, but unfortunately, she won't be able to do the same with her hand. But if I know anything about Bianca Belair, I know she will work her darnest to come back and beat Bailey next time. That was